My research says that we're losing money on the John John channel. Look at these papers. We're broke. You know what we need to do? We need to come out with new merch. What what do people like? What what do people like, John? Well, 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 sir, I I I think people people like J John. Brilliant me. This is why I pay you the big bucks. All right, all right. So what's the idea? What do we got? Anyone got any ideas? Any big ideas? Bigger ideas? Big ideas. Wait. I have an idea. I'll be back. You have no idea what I had to go through to put myself on a shirt. It hurts. It hurts so much. This is a real me. I had to find me. I had to pummel it down on a piece of shirt. In fact, every shirt that has a John on it, that's a real John you're wearing. John in the pocket's a real John that you carry around against its will. You can take it to your party, your birthday party, your other parties, your parties. John has no choice in the matter. Take him anywhere. Buy the shirt. Teespring.com. It's in link in the description. Thank you. This is Pocket John. The John wasn't really talking, it was the pocket all along. Pocket John. No! Where are you? I'm... I'm in the entrance of Freddy Land. I'm literally at the back. At the Well, the front. Well, the back of the front. Do you Does not... Yeah, 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 it makes sense. Okay, good. <sighs> Brian, you... I'll just, I'll just talk to you when I get in the damn place. You understand? Oh, okay, uh, I'll be right here. Right. No freaking board meeting sticking up for you. Board meetings you weren't at. Davis has quit. And now this shit. What more could go wrong? What are you looking at? Excuse me, sir. You don't happen to have a certain pass, would you? No. I, I, I run the business. What, what are you on about? I'm sorry, sir, but you're going to need to have a pass. I don't need one. I'm going to go ahead and go. Mm, yes, you do. C could you do me a favor? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You can look around your little desk and find where I fucking asked. Fuck. Is, Is everyone it, here no? an incompetent idiot? Oh, hey! If it isn't oh. my favorite, favorite park owner! Well, I, hold on. Mm. You kidding? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Was that for your stress? Uh, yeah, this is like my third cup because I was not waiting for you to come today and I'm a little nervous and I didn't want to freak you out. <laughs> you do realize the last meeting I had with everyone involved was about how I was staying here to help you run this park and I got so much crap for it. Like, they, they literally opened me up with all the what? things I'm doing wrong here with you. Because they want to shut you down. They want to tear down your park. Wait, tear, tear it down? No. And I'm the only reason it's not. Davis doesn't think the, the that you're profitable. No, in, no branch manager thinks you're profitable. Neither does any of the stockholders. And they want me doing something else. And then I hear half your park gets blown up. It, okay. To be fair, it wasn't even half the part. It was literally just the office, and it was only half of the office. Is building. that any better? Of course it's not, but it... Listen. One of the animatronics that we received back in the sewers turned out to be a bomb. And for some reason, we couldn't analyze that that was inside. We, we couldn't have known. Couldn't have known? What scrap animatronic were you trying to save? It wasn't a scrap animatronic for your information. It was Funtime Foxy. I lost animatronic for a while, and I'm only guessing that it was spying on us, and... And it, let me guess, it nearly killed you for something that you have? It nearly killed Molten. What? Molten was there with me. We heard a beeping, and for some reason, he suddenly knew what was going on, and he told me to get out before I could know it. The whole building exploded. You do not know. Not take me to him. Just take me to him. He should be in the office where I left him. Oh, is that not blown up too? Well, my lab is still intact, so I'm able to still fix things. But my, you know, office. What are you gonna say? What are you going to tell them? 
What am I gonna tell him? It, maybe it was a gas leak. Um, I don't know. Has any cops done any surveillance of the explosion yet? No, just the fire department came. I just explained that there was a minute. Roy, I need you to make something go away. Yeah. Roy. Needs to look like it was in a, a gas leak explosion. Don't worry about it. Just get it done. Take me to where Molten is so I can take him somewhere to get repaired. Okay. Wait, 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 I've been repairing him fine. I'll take him to someone who can actually do a good job. Take Wait, me. you don't think I can do a good job at fixing animatronics? You know I've been learning, right? I've been learning? making my own. I'm, I'm mad. And that's going to come out on you right now. But take me to where he is. Okay. It has nothing to do with your quality assurance of you being a good repairman. Yeah. <laughs> has everything to do with Molten's importance to me. Molten's important to me, too. He's my friend. Huh. Molten? Where are you? Oh, there you are. Oh, you're standing! Oh, why do I hear an annoying voice? Molten, it's me. I know. And John. <laughs> oh, hello, boss. How's it going? Sorry, I can't get your coffee right now. You look like you're in worse wear. Don't even think you could run the coffee machine, much less get it for me. Oh, I could try. Just I can't move my legs. Sorry if my hands jitter too much. You look just like you were when I found you. In pieces. Yeah, <laughs> to be fair, that half you took onto me was rather weak. I need new metal. Something stronger. Uh, of course you will. Uh, a stronger? Yes. It could be stronger than what he is already. Something more fine. What I made him out of was scrap from that factory I was in with Afton. Uh, we're going to need something uh, more pure. I'll have to call some people. You took some people. This explosion, Molten. What were they trying to do and get? Kill. Brian? Of course. Um. They were trying to get this thing called the portal timer. Ah, uh, he does not need to know that. Oh, so you want me to keep it a secret from him now? Ah, uh, just telling you. He has no idea what it is. I don't need to know. It's fine. Molten, I'm very sorry that you have been hurt. I'll do my best to try to repair you. You think you can fix this? Yes, I do. <laughs> uh, but I can try to do the same thing for Molten. Sure. Unless that's your wish, Molten, to go with John. Oh, I have I do not care who fixes me right now. I want the ability to at least walk. Okay. I'll get the metal shipped here. Okay. Okay. Does I, that mean I need to have a word with him? <laughs> this is gonna be fun. Okay, and then I'll give you the room. I'll be out here if you need anything. It's broken. Of course it is. Explosion did that. Doesn't seem like anything works around here. Well, give him some credit. An explosion does tend to break things, wouldn't you say? Be honest. How are things? How are things? Oh, if Brian hadn't turned off my pain receptors, I'd be screaming. You're not going to make it. Not too long without those parts. Oh, of course I won't. I'm running on our juices right now. Guess I can feel it. Like, Slowly I am dying. I've never known you to play it's... sacrifice play. Why? 
Who do you mean, why? You don't care about Brian. You don't know me. We spent, I don't know how many hours together, tormenting <laughs> each other. Walter. We listen close. Don't pretend you know me or my reasons. Fine. I'm still going to get you those parts, though. Ah, that's great. Ah, do me a favor, though. Sure. If you see a little green swirling ball of energy, don't touch it. Of course. Just run as far as you can. They're going to come back for him, aren't they? Oh, of course they will. They'll probably come for me, too. I give them a couple of hours. Do we need to get you fixed? You're not going to be able to. Not that soon, but we'll do what we can. Put yourself inside something. You think I have the ability to move my legs? No, but you have the ability to think, and you're one of the smarter people that I know. Hey, I need to go talk to him now about the parts. Uh, wonderful. See you around, boss. Shouldn't you be calling Brian that? <laughs> we'll never reopen. Not at this rate. Huh? I don't get it. I don't get it. I don't get why Molten did it. I never will. It's not my place to anyway. I don't know what kind of danger you're in either. So I'm not mad at you. And I don't think I can be justifiably angry at someone who I know keeps running into problems. Whatever it is, it's going to happen again. Obviously, you know that. Someone else is going to end up getting hurt. I bet Molten knows that. He doesn't want me near it either. So if it just shows you how much he actually cares... There it is, I suppose. I'm ordering some metal. It's going to be stronger than okay. titanium. What I need you to do is melt it down into coils. They'll be shinier than the ones he already has. Coils? Okay. You need to wrap them in threes. And then you need to heat it up. All right? Everything... Three's and heat them up? Okay, okay. What else? After you make it, Molten should be able to walk you through attaching them to his extra into skeleton parts if any of those things are broken however you should be able to easily reattach them with parts you have around the pizzeria what's more important is to get him walking get him able right. to go around the park everything else yeah the park may not open back up i'll see i can't do anything about it right now they want to kick me out of the position anyway, replace me with someone new. They're already trying to find someone to replace Davis's job with. And you know what else what really gets me? As I've been spending the whole time talking about how this park is one of the most financially stable brands that we have left. And there's a hole in it. Come to Freddy Fazbear where you can lose your foot. I wow. get it. I get it. And I don't understand it. I'm here for you, buddy. I it's really just beyond am. you and me this time. Is it? It is. Brian, you're going to... No, it's... I was never just there. Saying. I was never there for the other people in my life. I was never there for the people that it was too late to go. I was never there for Dawn. I wasn't there for Juper. I, I've never been able to make the right decisions to help those who really needed me. Please, Brian... I don't want to look back a year from now and you be on that list of people that I've hurt. Okay. I think you need something smaller to run. I don't think you can handle this. Maybe the new thing that I'm creating will be that smaller thing. Until then, I'll have some people come out see what we can do about this. Maybe you just tear the whole thing down. By the way, this is a freaking hazard and a half. Uh, I didn't think about that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Merchandise. You've done something I've never been able to do. And that's relate to Molten's humanity. 
You just have to treat him like one. What? Not like a monster? You know what he did to my friend? You know what he did you know to what Jab? He did to me? I don't know. Did he hang a guy from your ceiling? Did he whip someone that you loved and cared about? And torture him for months on end? So then why do you hang around him still? Because he's mine. No, the animatronics are mine. They're my friends. I guess that's the difference, huh? I guess so. Um. Are you said you're you might be losing your position. They'll probably push me out eventually, and after that, they'll definitely try to close down this park within a week. However, so I. Then what does that mean for me? Well, you could open up a new franchise, a new restaurant. What you're already doing, basically, without the Fazbear name on it. I assume that glam rock idea of yours is going to take off. In anymore, you know, you want to know what's funny? They're going to get someone to run this restaurant to the ground, and when it does, I'll buy their stock back, penny on the dollar. I'll come back and fire every single one of them. And after that, no one will be able to take anything. Don't, I hope you're right about that. Don't get yourself hurt. Is it me talking to you as a friend? I don't understand why he did that for you. I really don't. If you're his friend, good job. I'm really impressed. But that freak ain't my friend. 